we are building the biggest aircraft in the world uh, dedicated to uh, cargo transportation, uh, no passengers. We are a French-Canadian company. We've been working on this project for 10 years now, uh, but we're coming to the end of the engineering phase uh, and soon starting the industrial phase. We are between cargo airplane uh, that have big cargo um, uh, uh, possibility, but need infrastructure, big infrastructure like airports in the beginning and at the end. And, and between the helicopter that is really flexible, that can load and unload on stationary flight as well, but has a, a, a quite a low uh, payload capacity, up to uh, four to five tons uh, for, for, uh, for the biggest one. Well, even 12 tons for the very biggest one, but there are not a, not a lot uh, of them in, in the world. 60 tons. 60 tons. Yes. And, and so uh, we will, with this aircraft, access uh, locations that are uh, remote, uh, where uh, the, the transportation uh, um, uh, infrastructures are uh, limited or, uh, or non-existent, these solutions will be a great solution. Coming to the end of the engineering phase, uh, next year, uh, we will start to build the first uh, final assembly line to assemble the first airship. It will be located in the southwest of France, near Bordeaux. We will then have a second final assembly line in Quebec because the government of Quebec is a, is at the, is a shareholder of the company. And we are now trying to find a third location for a third uh, factory in Asia Pacific. It's for the French one. It's uh, it's a hundred million uh, tickets to uh, build and uh, and um, and equip this uh, facility. First, the money we we have is for the development of the solution. Uh, so we've been raising three times uh, money. Once uh, ten million in uh, 2017. The second time, 30 millions in 2019, and the last time was uh, last year in 2022. Uh, we raised 122 millions. Our shareholders are both uh, uh, public actors like uh, State of France, State of Monaco, State of uh, Quebec, uh, but also private partners like ADP, uh, like uh, Air Liquide, like Bouygues, which is a French uh, uh, engineering group. Um, so yeah, we have different kind of uh, investors. So the gas, the lifting gas is helium. It's, uh, it's uh, an inert gas, so no, no safety uh, problems. And these guys give us the lift so we can stay airborne. We, we work with a lot of different uh, players. We, we've signed already uh, more or less 40 uh, pre-agreement, pre-commercial agreement with, uh, with different players. So these are not contracts, but the, the, the phase before. Um, in the wood sector, uh, in the wind energy sector to transport the wind blades. Um, we work with the uh, humanitarian actors like the World Food Programme, the Red Cross, uh, to transport humanitarian uh, um, cargo after, for example, a, a natural catastrophe. Uh, we work with aerospace to transport satellites, a lot of different players. We, 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 we have estimated a need of uh, 800 airships throughout the world. Uh, for now, we plan to produce 160 airships uh, during the 10th first year of uh, production, but the market is bigger.